It's hard to believe that with the technology and tools available to modern archaeologists today, there could be any pieces of history that remain mysteries. That's what makes these 10 ancient artifacts that scientists still can't explain especially intriguing. Number 10. The Voynich Manuscript Inside this medieval book is a world of mystery, an unrecognizable alphabet, and delightfully strange illustrations. The Voynich manuscript has been carbon dated to somewhere between 1404 and 1438, and its calfskin binding indicates it was written somewhere in northern Italy. At the turn of the 20th century, it ended up in the hands of antique bookseller Wilfred Voynich, who the book is named after. The strange alphabet has been studied by archaeologists and linguists alike for over a century, but no one can decode what it actually means. Some wonder if it's written in an ancient form of Hebrew or an unknown language that's died altogether. Others wonder if it was written by aliens. Some believe the whole thing is a hoax or a practical joke, that the mysterious language isn't even a language at all. Number 9. Roman Dodecahedron the first of these ancient Roman objects was found in 1739, and since its discovery, 116 similar objects have been located. So what's so intriguing about this small, ancient Roman sculpture? Well, other than the fact that it's hollow and constructed from a copper alloy, scientists can't say much about it. They've been able to date it back to the 2nd and 4th centuries AD, but that date isn't enough to make sense of it completely. There have been zero references to the objects found in literature or art from the time, which only adds to the mystery. It's widely believed, because of the large quantity of the objects discovered, that this was a basic household item, like a candlestick holder or a paperweight. Some suggest it might even be a religious or fortune-telling object. Still, this is all mere speculation. Scientists may never know exactly what these bizarre objects were used for, but they will continue to study them. Number 8. The London Hammer The London Hammer is not named for the metropolis in England. It's actually named for the small town of London, Texas, where it was discovered in 1936 by a pair of hikers who noticed something strange sticking out of a rock. After breaking it open, they found a 6-inch metal hammerhead. So what's so mysterious about a hammer that was stuck in a rock? Well, hammers date back to about the 1800s, but the rock it was encased in dates back to 65 to 135 million years ago. It's unknown how the hammer found its way into the ancient piece of rock, but some theorize that the hammer itself was ancient, a tool from an ancient and advanced civilization. Unfortunately, the owner of the hammer has not had it carbon dated, so one can only guess at the age of the hammer itself, and why and how it ended up inside an ancient rock in Texas. Number 7. The Iron Pillar of Delhi This 22-foot-high iron pillar stands prominently in the square of Delhi, India. It might not look like much more than an old column at first glance. This pillar, though, isn't just any regular statue. It's nearly 1,600 years old, and scientists can't explain how something constructed of iron could have possibly survived that long. It should have rusted away centuries ago, but that's where the mystery lies. It seems that this pillar, made of about 98% pure wrought iron, is somehow incapable of rusting. After careful examination, scientists discovered that the pillar is protected by a film called misawite, which is created likely by accident. The misawite was created from a combination of things, a shortage of lime available when constructing the pillar, changes in the weather cycles, and the presence of raw slag. In all, misawite is made of iron, oxygen, and hydrogen, which doesn't rust. Number 6. The Nazca Drawings about 250 miles south of Lima, Peru, there's a series of gigantic designs etched into the ground. In all, there are more than 800 lines drawn into the plain, some stretching as much as 30 miles long. These drawings were made by the ancient Nazca people of South America and are believed to be around 2,000 years old. The drawings show about 70 different types of plants and animals and more than 300 geographic shapes. Puzzlingly, the drawings can only be viewed as a whole from above. This fact has stumped scientists who cannot understand how the drawings were created at such a scale without the artist ever being able to examine their work or why they were created in the first place. The best guess is that the drawings had an astronomical or calendar purpose. Others think that the purpose of the drawings changed over time, from astronomical to a way to study plants or animals. Number 5. The Skulls of Motala in 2009, archaeologists discovered a Stone Age settlement in southeast Sweden, and in it, they found 11 ancient human skulls that are believed to be about 8,000 years old. 
Two of the skulls were plunged into a wooden stake. The skulls found belonged to people across a variety of ages, from infants to children to adults. Scientists aren't sure whether these skulls are part of a strange burial ritual or religious practice, or if they were the result of some kind of ancient mass murder, and may never know. Number 4. The Dropa Stones In 1938, archaeologist Dr. Chipu Tai was leading an exhibition in China's Bangka Ula River when he discovered hundreds of stone discs buried in a cave. They were about the size of phonographic records, with a spiral rotating from their edges and a large hole in the center. Along the spiral were hieroglyphics that, according to Dr. Chu, told a story of spaceships captained by aliens called Dropa who crashed their ships into a mountainside. No one believed the scientist's translation, however, and the disks were sent to Moscow for further study, where they seemed to have disappeared. Today, no one knows exactly what the disks may have been used for or where they're kept. No further research of the bizarre objects has ever been published. Some believe that they may have never even existed in the first place. Number 3. The Holy Jar When archaeologists discovered the shattered remains of an 1800-year-old Roman artifact, they thought they were recreating a regular jar. That is, until they finished and found that the jar was covered in holes. Scientists then were left perplexed. What would this strange vessel have been used for? The jar has been sent to researchers and pottery experts around the world, but so far, no one's been able to decipher what its purpose was. It's possible it could have been used to trap rodents or be used as an ancient lamp. This theory has been questioned, however, because a hole at the bottom of the vessel would make it hard to be used as a lamp. As of now, the use of the strange vessel is anyone's guess. Number 2. The Sword in the Stone no, we're not talking about the stone from the fairy tale. This sword in the stone is all too real, and it's on display in a chapel in Tuscany. It's believed that the sword belonged to a nobleman, Galgano Guidati, in the 12th century. As the legend goes, Guidati was a violent knight who decided to turn his life around after a vision from the archangel Michael. Still, he had not given up his earthly possessions, including his sword, and another angel visited him, telling him that he must give up his possessions if he truly wants to commit to his new life. To this, the man replied, it would be easier to cut a stone with this sword than to do that. He then lifted his sword and stabbed a stone with it to prove his point, but shockingly, the sword plunged right through the stone with ease. Regardless of whether this legend is fact, one truth is clear. The sword in this stone isn't coming out anytime soon, and no one can really understand how it made its way in there in the first place. Number 1. The Antikythera Mechanism could the first analog computer date back to ancient Greece? Apparently, it can. The Antikythera mechanism is widely acknowledged as the first example of a device similar to a computer, and it was used by ancient Greeks to predict astronomical positions and eclipses, as well as to track the cycle of the ancient games similar to the ancient Olympics. The artifact was discovered in a shipwreck near the island of Antikythera. Remarkably, the device has not been mentioned in any Greek literature or illustrations, and seems to be the only one of its kind. No similar technological design was implemented until the 14th century. Nobody knows how the ancient Greeks managed to build this complex mechanism without any prior technology available. One day, scientists hope to find out. If these mysterious ancient artifacts intrigued you, go ahead and click those like and subscribe buttons. Thanks for watching.